uh, welcome everybody my name is avril matre and today i will show you that how to do image analysis or getting description from an image in azure and uh, we will be using um, python as a uh, programming language and we'll be using cognitive service in the azure portal so first either you can go here data resource um, you will get this marketplace like something uh, or a marketplace or you just go here go to so or search services uh, just uh, type in here marketplace or the third way is just uh, uh, go here search resources go here and click on cognitive services now we want to actually create it or uh, not a uh, not for the as an umbrella resource not a particular we don't want to use only one type of thing from it so we will uh, we will better use marketplace service uh, come here at marketplace search here at search here at cognitive service it will show us a multi service storage account cognitive service uh, we get this and we can create and you can create a new resource group uh, of your choice like i would like to name it az coz svcs ai 102 demo okay and the region as i am in india so uh, i will choose here central india and name of the service would be az coz cog svcs ai 102 uh i am doing it this in purpose of a102 so just like, you can name it anything either a z c o z so as as c v s we are taking this as an ai102 module so let's keep it as a z c o z s v c s let's keep it uh, ai102 demo again uh okay pricing tier keep it standard as so uh we want to keep it free or 1000 uh, transactions uh before uh, launching this video i should have delete i will delete it because i'll be using keys and endpoints next tags uh, keep that off actually we don't need it next tags leave them free new review and create validation required information or missing uh, or information is missing or not valid is something i'm, is, I'm missing okay we have to check this next identity next text next review and create and we will review and create running final validation validation passed and uh, we can create let's wait until it creates one it this uh, this made this within a snap of a finger in just 5 seconds uh, the deployment was really fast and as uh, the indian indian um, server is nearby me as i am living in india so that did faster because the indian servers were nearby me in new delhi and that's why it is easy to access and we can go to resource by the way you should choose the uh, server nearby your place and check while uh, a particular type of services services available on that server or not then uh, okay Uh, we are done and now we have to we have to use some type of code uh, here is the code go got to get it a102 files and then uh, what you need to do is by the way the link would be in the description either way you can copy from here pause the video and you can copy i hope you have copied then uh, computer vision analyze images using computer vision api then we have to just to image analysis which is relevant this one uh, retrieve image descriptions dot py then what we need to do is copy all of this and let me explain you one by one what where it is we are using azure cognitive services and computer vision this is type of a computer vision so we are doing uh, image analysis and we will we will call computer vision client and then we will use operation status code visual uh, feature types and uh, the credentials a uh, cognitive service credentials 
which are subscription key and endpoint then from array import array this is a module uh, built in module in python then we have import os then as we will be accessing a file from our operating system then we have import sys import time then subscription key we have to put the azure uh, service subscription key here so for that we will go to keys and endpoints uh, we will do that later on endpoint uh, subscription key would be pasted from where we will copy this and paste in the respective field we will just do the practical uh, right away endpoint uh, this is the endpoint we will copy and paste that computer vision client this needs to be this is set a default the remote image url this is the url of image what what we want to really analyze of then uh, it will tell uh, this is the format of what uh, the image would go as like this uh, when the process will start it will print this and will show the uh, computer vision client describe image remote image url then it will print description uh, this is there's a headline and then it will print the description results which we got from the uh, uh, computer vision api is equals to zero and if no description was got to it then it would be no description de detected and if there was any caption it would show something like this for caption and description if a caption is detected then print uh, print with confidence score as we are using a format as you can see caption dot text we are leaving this free uh, the format a uh, function will fill this up with caption dot text confidence score will be uh, this one will be filled by caption confidence and multiply by 100 means the uh, some kind of percentage we want to take off and then it or average we need average right now describe an image local if the local path uh, we have images landmark jpeg uh, there should be a remote URL which would be accessed from the internet. Then, uh, then a, a local image path, and then open local image path which is given under this variable RB as a root binary. Then description result describe an image in stream local image. So this is a, a function called from computer vision client which des describes an image in a stream. Uh, and uh, what would be the path of the image is local image then get the captions uh, like uh, previously we did we will show off the uh, description so let's get this code copied and we will first of all go open our open the text out of a choice or uh, in this in my case it would be vs code wherein so we will open a folder, make a folder first, like a demo or something. If you have a folder, then with uh, or either way, you can uh, get this folder off. And and actually, you can make a file and save it as a uh, as in a free space. Uh, you might have to select a folder like I am doing. Com not compulsory. I am just doing for my convenience. We will select this folder. It does not exist on the computer. Okay, we don't want to access this. Sorry. Open folder. Then Python programs. Select folder. Uh, it's opened here. And uh, we will delete this and do this from the starting. Move to recycle bin. Then we have copied this code actually then let's create a new file uh, image analysis getting okay the image analysis getting file or folder name image analysis getting okay or we can say getting image description dot py please choose a different name Okay, we want to create a new file, not in this one. We will create that a free. Retrieving image description. 
dot py and now we'll paste the code here okay let's copy this first paste it here then what we need to do is fill the subscription key and endpoint here then uh, first we need the subscription key which is this key one api key we will paste this over here and endpoint enter your key url endpoint here uh, enter your endpoint url here so we will paste this and we need to firstly download some of the modules in python so the first one we need is we will first of all open up the terminal new terminal and we will first paste this command pip install azure cognitive services vision computer vision uh, i have already downloaded so it will take some time in yours and now the second one is pip install azure it won't take time in mine as i have already installed otherwise it's a really big package it will take time in your computer if you haven't installed it already then these are the two modules we need uh, now we can run it right click run python file in the terminal okay describe an image remote no such directory images landmark dot jpeg we need to first go here i could have come here images landmark download as right click save image as then what it was asking for is uh, i will go to my folder and create a new folder here called images as it was ex expecting the path of we haven't made one so it is ex expecting something like the a folder should be images and a uh, file should be there landback.jpg so we fulfilled this criteria and now it will successfully run okay you can see the both images were the same an ancient city with many ruins with colosseum in the background uh, let's open that image first what it really looks like uh, so what was it saying we need to open the current it was let's run it first and see what it was saying an ancient city with many ruins yeah this looks like does look like an ancient city with many ruins yes uh, this is all ruined actually uh, in with colosseum in the background this does look like a colosseum this one is called colosseum my mouse is going over there and th this area will be colosseum so this is it for this video as we have already covered that what we need to i have explained uh, the fullest that you need to uh, understand to make this code successful or understand it in your own words the better understanding of the computer vision apis so uh, i hope that i have sure shown you the fullest you can ever see to know about this and with this said let's end up